Hi, I'm Toby from AbletonDrummer.com. I quickly want to show you how you can use my drum patches, my drum tuning patches, which are dedicated to the drum rack and to the impulse sampler. They can be used for playing melodics as well, but they are designed for the drum rack and for the impulse. And I want to show you this with a drum cat because especially a drum cat is sometimes not that easy to tune. Um, maybe you tuned it once or twice and then after half a year you want to redo it and you have to fiddle around, get into it, uh, how you did it and stuff. So with the my patches it's really easy just uh, easy going and uh, you can save your preset and then just recall it or drag and drop it when you need it. Okay, so let's start with the drum tuner for the drum rack. You just need a MIDI clip uh, with the drum rack on it and then you just drag and drop my patch or my device, the drum rack tuner in front of it. And now you can set it on or th on through. You can reset all the notes if you need to and there is a window where you will see which MIDI note is coming in. So you now can just um, change these numbers, um, transpose them automatically. So for example if I want to play the kick with a certain pad, I just need to train the kick, hit the pad and now you can see it's transposed automatically uh, two octaves down. So if I play it now, I get the bass drum. Same would be with the snare drum, for example. So the drum tuner would automatically tune um, to the right MIDI note. So you can now um, save this as a preset, for example. Rename it, put it into your user library, and then if you ever need it again, you can just um, drag and drop it in front of your um, in front of your drum rack. And every time you need a different one, you can just uh, or you can circle through uh, different presets as well if you want different tunings in uh, the same live set, for example. Okay. Let's have a look to the impulse one. Um, so here it is quite the same. Um, the impulse is a bit limited on one side, but the limitation on the other side is quite interesting. So for example, you can change the transpose, uh, the stretch or the filter um, with the velocity. Um, so by hitting harder, um, it would get higher or um, lower if you hit lower as well. So just drag and drop the drum tuner impulse, max patch or max device in front of it and here it is the same. Turn it on, you can reset the values. You don't have to reset the values, it will um, do it by itself. So now let's um, train it here. You can only train it one at a time, so because my drum cat is tuned similar to these notes, which the drum, uh, which the impulse needed. This is not; um, it was playing different notes as well. But just to give you uh, to give you uh, an impression, I think this will do it. Okay, so um, just get the drum tuners and have fun.